never leave baby unattended. Three-way high chair. Curb find, trash find. It's been sitting around here for a while. I'm going to have to get to it. Nothing wrong with it. Wicker's fine. Boards are fine. Cool find. Found it on the curb. The finger pincher. This is what was wrong with it. These, let's call them brackets. These were all bent because I have a feeling what happened was these little compression springs, I don't know how the hell to put it on here, but these little compre compression springs must have fallen out. And this little hook, I don't know how the hell to do this, but this little hook right there goes into these slots. And I believe what happened was the compression springs probably fell out. These little, these little hooks got caught up in these slots. All right. Stranding. I, I, I would imagine they got caught up in here. And mom was trying to get toddler out. Her dad was trying to get the toddler out. Got into a panic. Couldn't get it out. Grabbed a large screwdriver and got up in there and started twerking and prying. And it got all it got all wet. And then after panic mode set in, and after they got toddler out, she said, put the thing out. I don't care if it was yours when you were a child. Get rid of this thing. So I went to the curb. <clears throat> and I come along and grab it. And all it was, again, straighten these little brackets out. Straighten the brackets out. And they actually sell these brackets on Amazon for like 14 bucks. And I put some compression springs in. Harbor Freight compression springs. Good old Chinese compression was made in China. <laughs> Shit, they went everywhere. Anyways, they worked. And slot goes in. Goes in. Get the kit in the slot. It works. Yeah, you piece of junk. Get over there. There you go. Get the tuner in there. Fucking way it works. And then uh, keep from getting your fingers pinched. You slide it up. And it works. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Now what the hell do I do with it? I guess I could... I don't know what the hell to do with it. But anyways. Save from the dumpster. Save from the trash. Save from the compactor. Mom and dad who threw it out. They don't have to worry about the toddler getting hung up in there. They left it on the curb for some jabroni, and I'm the jabroni that come along and grabbed it. So what to do with it? I don't know, I'll give it away. I'll give it to somebody. Give it to Goodwill. Put it on uh, eBay for 40 bucks. They really don't build stuff like they used to. I believe it's all maple. No cracks. Tell you what, this thing is put together nice. Mid-century, my research says. 1940s, no, mid-century, mid-century is 50s to 70s, I don't know, I think that's right, so that is a mid-century Gerber three-way rocker, I, you know, what is the three-way here, all right, let's thought about that, there's rocker, then, I guess, uh, high chair with the table. I think you can see that. High chair with the table. Oh, that works so smooth. And, uh, we're back to, I guess, is it rocker with a table? I guess that's the three-way. Who cares? Anyways, 
I love finding stuff on the curb. Good stuff. I don't like finding junk. I leave the junk. Leave the pressed wood. It's like I like looking for the good furniture. I get excited. Actually, I have I feel a little empathy for furniture sitting on the side of the road. It's nobody wants to take care of it. They don't want it. It's it's uh, just junk to them. I get a tear in my eye when I, I get a little misty eyed. I said, you know, come to me, furniture. I will rescue you. <clears throat> Anyways, I'm gonna shut up. That's all I got. This is my little 15 minute project this thing's been sitting in this shop for a year and that's all i had to do was add a couple springs i gotta make more time for this all right that's all i got i'm out of here i'm going to work three-way rocker these things here I, I don't know why i make these they just take up too much time all right i'm out of here i gotta go to work see ya